Hey guys, Plasma Mastodon 911 here. So, um, today I'm doing a Minecraft video, uh, but don't worry, I'm not stopping my LEGO videos. My LEGO videos will still be coming out, um, soon, and I think I'll alternate LEGO video, Minecraft video, um, like that. So, as far as Codwell and Jake, I have the sixth episode coming out soon, and as far as, um, the Minecraft mini world, I have finished the nether, and I'm now working on the end, um, and so let's go ahead and play some Minecraft. So, on Roamcraft, I would play that, except that no one's on right now, so it'd be pretty boring, yeah, and on Hades, this is my other, this is actually my favorite server, um, because I'm a donator on it, uh, I actually have recently gotten raided, it's a raid um, slash PvP slash factions server, which I really love. I don't like any other type of server. Um, I recently got raided. I don't know how, um, but it's a pretty. I have a pretty bad base. I just claimed a piece of land out in the wilderness now, but um, it's pretty sad. And oh, and also, um, for those of you who are watching that are actually in my faction on Hadescraft, um, I we got raided. And somehow our faction was disbanded. So, um, I'm the admin, by the way, of our faction. And, uh, somehow it said that I was no longer a part of our faction. So, I reclaimed our land and reclaimed everything. But sometimes there's glitches on the faction servers where, uh, we, uh, we just, the factions just sometimes get erased by accident. But that didn't happen often. This is like the first time it's happened in five months or something. So, it's pretty good. But, um, we're gonna go ahead and join the server. And I'm out in the middle of the ocean, I believe. Yeah. And I thought I was, yeah, I'm on a boat. So, I am a donator. See? If I go, hey guys, um, it says Bedrockers, that's my faction. That's an epic username. That's also the username of my faction name on Julian's server, jbaron43. And then I'm a knight, um, and that's my username. Crazy username, I know. So, uh, let's see. So, that's my old base down there with the glowstone that you see. It was underwater, just like in Julian's server, but... <sighs> yeah, it's sad. Um, actually, that was not the base that got raided. We moved somewhere else. Um, but then we got raided there, for my faction members watching. So, I've learned, guys... So, to actually, today we're just gonna do some mining. And I've learned, guys, that the best way to mine on a server is to go out into the middle of the ocean. And for the reason, and um, the reason for that is because when there's only water, then wow, oh, entities can kill the boats. I forgot. Wow. Okay. Hold on, guys. I'll just have to do a makeshift uh, uh, lifeguard act here. Oh yes, build the boat. Okay, so, um, what was I saying? Recently we got raided, our old base, oh yeah, um, so the best way to mine is to go in the ocean and to go underwater and mine under, like, in the ground under the ocean that's, like, far away from spawn, because for the reason that, um, the reason for that is because when the world is just water in this area, when these chunks that you see loading here, when they're just water, well then the world has to generate something because it can't just be stone, dirt, and water. They need to generate something in the land. So they have nothing else to join, uh, to spawn except for um, mine shafts. So that's a great way to get spawners. Since I'm a donor, I can do slash ender chest and this is pretty much everything I own right here, which is pretty sad, really sad. This is all protection two. These are my kits, protection two diamond armor. That's just the, the kit for night. So I guess we could stop here. Um, as you can see, I barely have anything of value at all. But in case my food grows low, what I do is I just bring bones and carrots because if I find some dirt, I can just quickly grow them. People think that you need water to grow wheat, potatoes, and carrots. They're wrong. You do not. They will grow very slowly, but you do not need water to grow those vegetables. 
Um, so right now I'm just looking for a little mountain or something that protrudes out of the water because um, then I don't have to go scuba diving to mine. Uh, it's going to be really annoying if I have to go all the way down there without dying just to mine. So um, I do have a silk touch though and I can wait, let's try that again. I do have a silk touch though, but the sad thing is that's my only pickaxe besides these. It's just it's just pathetic. I mean, um, so <sighs> yep. So I guess we can. And then also I have a pretty op command which is slash p time day, and it instantly turns it day for me only. P time stands for personal time. By the way, guys, that is only for donating ranks above warrior so I'm knight so I can have that rank it's pretty simple I'm having uh, some lag here that looks pretty good right there but I don't know maybe not what's this can this load oh yes okay I, th I think we're gonna mine here okay so this is kinda what you wanna find guys this type of thing um, if you wanna go mining and I've brought some wood with me, as you've already seen. And so, the way to scuba dive, not many people know it. A lot of people are just scared of the water. But um, the way to scuba dive is to take signs. Because what you can do with them is, oh, and torches. Um, it's going to be pretty hard. I'm going to have to come up for air once, though. So, you just dive down here. And then you have to look up because otherwise you can't tell if you're still falling. And so the main way to get air is to just put little torches down. And then uh, you get a pocket of air and you get a little uh, sight thing. So I'm going to just do air and then I'm going to dig two blocks down. So. If I need air, I can just go like that and bam, I got air. So we're going to actually need to dig one more down. And this is pretty simple. And you just place the sign. And since everything in Minecraft equals one block, it's all measured in blocks, signs equal one block. So water cannot fall through here because the sign is taking up that block. But at the same time, a person can fit into a block where the sign entity is. And then what I do now is I just place the torch. Um, like that. And bam. That's how you scuba dive, guys. It's the best way to do it. If you don't know how to, that's how you should scuba dive. So, this is the problem, though. That's the only thing. You gotta dig down a little bit, even though that's kind of a no no in Minecraft. You gotta dig down a little bit just to get away from the sand. So, um, I gotta punch an area. I gotta punch an area that's not um, where sand is. So now we can just start mining, and then that's how you scuba dive. And already we found some iron, so so we can just get our iron pick out, mine that. Sorry guys, I have a sort of a sore throat, but um, hopefully that doesn't interfere too much with the video. Looks like we found a dirt pocket, I guess. And, yeah. So, I'm thinking, I'll just talk while I mine here. I'm thinking that what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a couple episodes on this server. But um, guys, comment on really what you want on Minecraft because, um, well, other than like a creative server because that's just lame. But, um, well, at least for me. I just don't, I don't know, I just like PvP. So, um, pretty much just comment on what you want because um, I can do that. I think I'll do, um, as I was saying, I think I'll do a couple episodes on this PvP server and then I'll make my channel a single player world where I can teach you guys the basics of Minecraft and just run through all of what Minecraft is and 
beat the end, you know, everything. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much my plan. All right, we already found Lapis. So, and if you want to, guys, I guess if you want to find this mine exactly where I was, um, I'm at 2KX and 20 already. Why? So, I've already dug 40 blocks down, so I should um, be able to find some diamonds soon. And I do hear water, which means caves, and caves can mean mine shafts. So, that's pretty, yeah, look at that, look at that. Do you see that, guys? I, I just, I dug in a straight line from a random position in the middle of the ocean. Bam, mine shaft. And I'm probably going to find a cave spider spawner. Yay. But another OP command of my donating rank is that I can actually um, change spawner types to spider, zombie, or skeleton. So that's really awesome. It's really good. It's a really good command. Um, so I guess I was like looking around first before. Hold on. Let's see. You want to always. You want to kind of look and see if there's a dead end. Because see, look, this track was a little tilted. So I thought um, some of the cobblestone spawned here. But there was another room back here. So I guess I was wrong. But sometimes that is the case. Where there's a whole other room over there. So I gotta remember to eat also. Um I hear water. That's that's always a good sign. Oh, stairs. Okay. I pretty much like scanning the area before I sit down to mine because then I know I'm safe and that there isn't a stupid cave spider spawner ready to just jump me right when I look down for a moment. So that's the reason behind that. I should find some pretty good iron and uh hopefully some I mean Diamonds would be great, but I get diamonds every other day because of my donating rank, so they're fine, but what I really need are spawners, because then I can make grinders to get XP. Um, so, yep. And then that torch just broke everything, which is awesome. Okay, this is getting really boring. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a shovel. Make a shovel like that, bam. So hopefully, guys, you've already gotten some tips and tricks um, from this episode. Uh, this is basically just a test episode for Minecraft, I guess. But comment on what you want to see on my channel. Um, I might not. I'm probably not going to take server requests because I already have some servers that I'm. Um, I already have a server, this server obviously, that I'm a donator on, so I'll probably stay with this server for a while. Um, but I guess just tell me like what you want, like multiplayer, single player, that type of thing. So um, yeah, I just grabbed some lava there because I can uh, do some stuff with it in the uh, in the nether. Or I can erase items by throwing it into it, and it burns the items. So, I actually haven't even found any coal yet. That's kind of hilarious. Okay. It's a little awkward, but... Let's see. Okay, wow. This is pathetic. Alright, so... I'm out of torches. Yay. That's awesome. I love it. Um, that's okay. I don't care. Really? I don't, I don't really get these columns in the mine shaft. I think they could have had a better design, but... I hear lava. That's not always a good sign. But... <clears throat> oh, lapis lazuli. Didn't even see that. I'm not even gonna... I'm not even gonna get that. It's pretty pointless, if you ask me. Alright. So, if you didn't uh, already notice, I'm mining because I need to get ma- Wow. Wow, are you kidding me? I, I'm mining because I need to get materials for my faction because we got raided. So, that's sad. It's pretty sad. Um, I'm just looking now to see if I can find some coal. 
I guess not, so that's Alright guys, so that's the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um sorry I had to cut that little part of the video out, but uh nothing really exciting else happened after what you just saw. But this is what I did end up getting. Some good stuff. Um but just make sure to subscribe. Um some other stuff actually is still at my faction base, so that's why some stuff is missing. I took two trips. But this is a, bu a bunch of the good stuff. And I got a bunch of gold, too. And some more diamonds. So, anyway, guys, um, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please um, make sure to subscribe for more if you like this video. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.